Welcome to the channel. In this episode, I'm gonna change this motor mount on the 99 Toyota Camry and the wires. Stay tuned. Okay, to get started, I'm gonna get this motor mount changed out. I believe it's like a 13, so let's see how that goes. Well, looks like a 14. Uh, you know, it's important to change the motor mounts just to make sure that your engine's not moving too much. Um, this is the top, they call it a torque strut mount as well, so this kind of keeps the top of the engine from rocking. Um, you know, if this one goes really bad, then it'll start loosening up the other one, so it kind of, it's gonna be a chain reaction. So I saw that this one's got like a big crack on it, so I'm gonna go ahead and get it changed out first. Normally on the bottom ones, you do have to support the engine. Um, this one, since it's on top, uh, we should be able to kind of wiggle it back and forth a little bit. We'll see how that goes. I can see that this bolt on the back side came right out, so that's good. This one's just a little bit tight, but that's just on the nut itself, so. All right, so we take both of the bolts out. And we can take the motor mount out. So you can see, um, you know, the rubber is pretty much torn. And then this side here too, it's, it's almost to the point where it's about to rip completely off. So. Got this one from Rock Auto. Uh, it was pretty inexpensive. I think this mount was like four bucks. So not bad price too. Make sure we don't have problems later on. Gonna get a little mallet just to pop. Let's see what's going on here. So it looks like I just need to push this other side down. And that might have been too much. Nope. Just enough. And then I'll move this one to line up this bolt. And there we go. And actually, Now that I look at it, I have to flip it because the... I'll show you this here in a second. So this bolt, uh, this metal piece, it's offset. So I'll make sure that it's to the other side.
so that way when this one lines up uh, the other way it was gonna be a little bit too crooked kind of so You might have to move the motor mount just a little bit back and forth to get the uh, hole to align to get the threads in there. But once you start it, and you'll go in pretty good. So. Next thing I'm gonna do is the wires and the plugs. So I'm gonna pull each one out. And I'm gonna and I'm gonna take all of them out all the way, just cause I want to make sure I keep them in the right order. But what I'm looking for is just making sure that there's no oil inside of here. Um, sometimes, you know, if your boot is full of oil in there. That pretty much just tells you that the valve cover gasket is leaking. And if that's going on, then you don't want to just put a new wire. You want to fix that valve cover. That, I'm also gonna put new plugs on there since I'm already taking these wires out. See how tight these are. That wasn't tight at all. Plugs are not too bad. Um, they're... I'm just gonna put a little bit of dielectric grease on the threads. Put these back under. Put the new wire in. And put some dielectric grease in there. Put it on there. I'm gonna take that second one out. There we go. Spark plug out. Good 
little bit of these and put it back on. Gonna put some dielectric grease here on the end again. Make sure it goes in there. Get the spark plug, anti-seize. When you're dropping them in here, make sure you don't, you know, drop it hard. Um, you might hit that electrode or that little tab and bend it. So just be careful. Grease. And get this less wire out. spark plug. Get some anti-seize on there as well. Put it back in there. Get my wire. Got some anti-seize in there.
and we're all set. Okay, so that's changing the motor mount, wires, and plugs, and a 99 Camry. Um, this is for the daily that I picked up, so I think it's good to go. Um, I have been driving it for a whole week already, but, um, you know, this is kind of the maintenance that you want to do to any car that you buy. You know, just make sure all these things are good. So um, it's good to go. I'm just going to make sure everything runs good and keep driving it. Uh, if you liked the video, leave a thumbs up. Any questions, comments, leave them below. Subscribe to our channel. See you in the next one.